Hello. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. are more expensive, but I'm always happy to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as... Look at that! What the... No! <laughs> you fool! Jesus! Oh uh, yeah! Thanks just had to get nasty! Watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you. What the fuck? Disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just... I want you to do something besides sit there eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Yeah, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. <sighs> Fuck me. A bike ride along Vespucci Beach? Uh, okay, Dad. I got just a thing to show you. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Ugh! Now you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? What the fuck? What's the big deal? 
If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How Jimmy. am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-faced? Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief... A liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years, but that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to ask. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Hey, man, what's good? We what's get up? For a Here we are at the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey, you! Two bikes. Take your pick. Yo, thanks. Oh, no! If I make it to the end of the pier first, you're gonna buy me a big-ass new flat like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! 
Dad, wait! Look, if you do go... Take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Our house? Yeah. Man, you got a killer pad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Those walls can talk. You think I do it? Hey. No. Hey. Shit, hey, Daddy. cool, man. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, oh, hey. Ah, oh, fuck, man. Come. I like that. What's the problem? You're such a jerk. Come on. Dad, you dumbass. These guys are serious. Yeah, well, so am I. Go to the scene of my fucking boat. Oh, motherfuckers. Get on, now. I'm about to skin you alive. God damn it. Go. Shit, they're coming after us. Go into that. Daddy, you just killed him. Hey, don't worry. It's amazing what modern medicine can do. Take a deep breath, baby. It's okay. I'm taking you back to your brother. You're a menace. I'm an accessory to murder. No, you're not. You're an accessory to self-defense. Have I, like, got to be a witness because I, I, like, did some blow? You did blow? Yeah, I did some blow, and that might, like, make my testimony inadmissible. You're not admissing anything. There won't be a trial unless you're on a trial for doing blow! After you ruined my day, stole my friendship, capped them, and I'm the one on trial? They started it. And we wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't hung out with some creepy-ass porno people and done blow! Ugh, you didn't know I did blow until I told you I did blow, so this should be like an increase in trust and honesty thing. And porno dudes are like the best dudes I could be with. Porno dudes? Really? Yeah, they actually respect women and treat us right. It's Los Santos, Dad. What do you expect when we moved here? Enough! This conversation is over. Keep hiding your head in the clouds. The 50s are over. Even the 80s are over. See, that's the problem. Because they're not over in my head. Well, grow up. Asshole, okay? He smashed my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes and he just went. I'm getting a cab. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life.
left you a message, remember me? Hello, man. Hello, man. Hello, man. Hello, man. Hello, man. Franklin! What's up, bro? You good? Yeah, um, Trill. Trill, homie. How's your day? Yeah, um, fine, I guess. I mean, he should be, right? He got you to help him out with stuff. I mean, I don't really see what he's adding in this partnership. Hey, look, bro. Man, I don't want to say too much on the phone, but things ain't good where I'm from, man. You know, ain't no glamour like you thinking, and, uh, man, I'm sick of putting myself out, man, and not getting paid, homie. Now, your dad? He seemed like a dude to put himself out, man, and got something to show for it. So I'm hoping some of that shine rub off on me, man. You feel me? Did you just say the streets are tough and it's tough if you're, like, a good man in a bad world? I share your pain, homie. For real. Homies for life. Yeah, man, I gotta go. My car! Tanisha Jackson, I guess I'm busy, so you know what to do. Crap! Hey, man, what's up? <laughs> what the fuck? Give me that motherfucker. Hey, 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 whoa, back off there, cowboy. I know my constitutional rights. Anyway, I know you're coming here to suck cock, so it's all right. What the fuck you talking about? Wow, well, hey, look, I saw a quarterback blues, man. And, you know, some of those older records of yours, even they sound a little bit closeted, I'm just saying. What? A black man walking in vine wood? You think he Clay PG sellout? You bitch-ass punk oh. motherfucker. Oh, shit, man. Oh, hey, I'm sorry, dude. I didn't, didn't have my, my contacts in, you know? I mean, I love black people. Yeah, you know, like, uh, like, I love gangsters. I love, like, gangster rap. Yo, sup? Man, who gives a fuck if he's gay or not, man? The man is not married. It's his business. Leave motherfuckers alone. Well, yeah, look, I'm, I'm just saying that that it's uh, it's the hypocrisy that I can't stand. You know, I mean, of celebrities. Right? I mean, PG, right? He, he, he says he, he's a killer and a murderer and all that great stuff. And then, what, he, he loves his mother and likes show tunes. I mean, really, what kind of message does that send in our kids? You know what I'm saying? The guy's a fraud. Well, why do you care, man? Well, yeah, because, you know why? Because they all think they're gods, right? Well, fuck them. Fuck them! Fuck them! Fuck them! Fuck! Them! Fuck them! They're not magic! No, no, they're no better than me. They're no better than me. Shit! Oh shit! Oh my god, it's Miranda! Miranda, I love you, Miranda! Come on! Come on, it's fucking Miranda fucking Cowan! Man, she's a fucking megastar! No, no, leave me out your shit, man. Oh no, no, no! We, we can make vocal bucks here, man! We get one picture of, of her of her hairy legs or her aging muff, and we are in the money, man! In the money, bro! Come on! Come on, man! Oh, what Come on! The fuck is wrong with me? Let's go! You drive, I'll get the shot! Go, go! Get us right up alongside that limo! Get in there! I got nothing here, man! You don't look a day over! 45! <laughs> Not that close! I don't believe it! She's slamming a speedball in there, man! This is journalistic gold! You're an angel! An angel? No 
Kramer off the road, man! Man, they don't call her the silicone slatter for nothing. She looks like a bloodhound in a wind tunnel. God, I love her! Oh, man, no wonder this whole town's in therapy. He's a goddess. He's a whore. Homewrecker! Harlot! The fans have a right to know everything! We done yet? No, she still looks too good. I want the prisoner of war shot. That's where the big zeros are. Give me something, anything. Oh, stop pretending to cry. Okay, let's go again. We need the money shot. Fuck you, Beverly. This one's mine. Oh, no, no. It's that bottom feeder, Madison. Shit, he's getting the money shot. Where's your dignity, man? Forget Miranda. We can't let him steal my exclusive. Get alongside him. I'll knock the... Jesus! You didn't have to kill the guy! Oh, and this is coming from a fool to just try to knock him off a moving motorcycle? Well, it's done now. A terrible accident, but life must go on. And I'm already late for my next stakeout. Let's go. Get the hell out of here. Oh shit, it's the cops! Get rid of them! So I should probably tell you this is not 100% legal. You gotta get rid of him! I'm in breach of my restraining order! Hi. There's a small parking lot by the Cafe Redemption Courtyard in Morningwood. Drop me there, and you can keep the bike, because I look after my people. Look after your people? And I know when the ride is hot. If this is your bike, then I'm the fucking Pope, dawg. Okay, okay. Don't ruin the vibe. I think I got a decent shot of Miranda back there. So we splitting what you get for the photo, 50-50, right? Yeah, well, I kind of thought the bike would cover your share. I mean, I did do all the work. Man, I probably shouldn't talk, dawg, but this is one fucked up line of work your ass in. It's about staying true to yourself. With muff shots? Miranda Cowan's 39 years old. We just made her day, man. They wanted the tramps. They court it. It's a beautiful, abusive relationship. So whose day you making next? Uh, Samantha Muldoon, the singer. I got a tip off she's buying a North Korean baby on the black market. The holy grail of adoption contraband. This could define my career. All right, homie. It's been an education, dawg. Look, keep on making the world a better place, you hear me? Yeah, the public needs to know. The fans deserve answers. Shit, not if the question is how low is Miranda Collins' muff hanging or if she getting banged out by some second-rate director? They need to know everything, from crow's feet to camel toes. Hey, 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 come by the manor next week. We'll continue the search for the truth. Look, don't wait around for me, homie. Oh, I'm waiting for you, homie. <laughs> 